I think we're live, live, live. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. I'm a little bit concerned. The stream was picking uh, a server in Mexico. Alright. How am I in Mexico? What's going on? Mm -hmm. Maybe my 360 is on my internet for a loop. It's been a minute since I used the Xbox 360. Hmm. So yes. Mm -hmm. I just put Xbox 360 at the top about the name of the game. That's alright, we'll leave it like that. I don't know, the 360 might push my system to the limit. So it looks like we can start. What's up, Triple Topper? Well, I'm assuming I'm coming in fine because it's the screen is remaining the same. Nothing's happening. What I need might need to do is disconnect my 360s from the internet. But something about the 360s and when you connect it to the internet, it just causes all sorts of issues. But I don't know. Me don't know the woza. Alright, so we're gonna start the timer. As you guys can see, this will be game number 88. I think this will be the 11th uh, 360 game. And this one was won by, uh, on the Push Your Luck uh, game pick by Happy Slappy. You got an instant pick, so it'll win above every other pick. Even in the 24 hour uh, stream that I started, which was last year this time, so. Crazy to think. Maybe it was long. It was way before last year. I mean, it was last year, but I think it was way over a year because I thought it was like in early beginning part of the year. All right, let's get this show on the road. People want to see games being played, so we'll start the timers. Now, all these games are gonna. We only have 2.75 gigs, three. Alright, everybody, uh, start a new game, but it's going to always take me a little bit longer to beat games, because I need to go to configure my controls. Uh, I don't care about this, I need aiming, gameplay settings, invert on, I don't care about that. Whatever, I will we'll leave default settings for that. I'm not gonna adjust anything like that, so. Alright, so let's start this. There's new downloadable content. Well guess what? We don't care. <laughs> let's watch this story. No, I don't although I should probably plug one in, but I don't want to spend any more money on stuff that I don't need to do. Especially since the Xbox One is somewhat backwards compatible. Xbox Live. I always like to go a little bit higher than it says. Actually, if I sit straight in front of the TV, I can't see it. All right. All right so. is the standard thing. I need to write that down though. Uh, so I know at the when we beat it, what it's called, what difficulty we're on. XCOM Veteran. That's, even though that's normal, it, it sounds way better than beating the game on normal if I beat it on Veteran, right? Yeah. 
Ooh, it's exciting. I haven't played a 360 game in ages. Here's the actual pace if you guys want to see, even though I have it up there. And then on the back side. The nations of Earth must someday make a common front against attack by people from other planets. Oh, snap. The Space Force. This is an alien game. Should I be afraid? Should we be very afraid? We've been intercepting these signals for the past six months. We still don't know their origin, but our analysts have concluded that they are encrypted orders for sleeper agents operating inside this country. Just the sort of thing Mr. Hoover has been warning about. Soviet operatives have penetrated the very highest levels of our military and government. It is a fact. The NSA is not convinced that this is a Soviet operation. Directors say the Soviets are causing problems all the way back to, into another to one of your outsider briefings. Well, there's been a new development. A device was recently recovered from the Illyrium mine in Bannock, Montana. The technology is unknown to us, but suggests the activity of a far more sophisticated organization. And where is this device? Close. Send Agent Carter down. <laughs> Give us some of that liquor right now. Make this mission enjoyable, you know? I miss you, Daddy. Mm. Agent Carter. I thought Agent Carter was a chick. Your escort. Director's orders. I don't need an escort. Well, you're getting one. How much have you been told? My orders are to deliver that case to Director Falk. That is all. And you haven't even been the least bit curious to what's inside? Uh, no. Good. But I'll have to make sure. No one touches that case except Director Falk and me. We'll see oh, about shit. that. Wait, did she kill me? I didn't even start the game and I'm already dead. It's here. Director Falk. This is it. Leave it to women to cause trouble. Drop it! What the hell? Shoot! I wouldn't have stood there. I would have shot that bitch. I would have shot her after she shot me. Why wait? Now they're gonna erase our minds, of course. Everything, nothing happened. Oh, nope, she's a crispy critter. Who saved us? Toothbrush and brush my teeth real quick. Uh, my head. Alright. Look at this crispy critter. Where's his briefcase at? Did someone steal the briefcase? The case. What happened? Alright, we need to get out of here. I think I had one too many. Someone stole the case and killed her. Dude, is that our level? Oh, I hate third person. 
I'm that dude do what I'm doing. He's military trained, and I'm just some agent. Not letting me go. I'm crossing the Oh. I guess I gotta look at it. I gotta get out of here. Scared, scared. Shooting at him. He obviously died. Are these guys gonna wake up? Let me show you how to play some pool. <laughs> I'll show you how to move that stick. I get to see an enemy, I see people shooting. There's no enemies. Oh, here we go, finally. Look at these little guys. I haven't played in forever. I guess it's awesome you get to hide behind a wall. This base is not gonna last long. I gotta go. I guess I'm not really hunting achievements, so I don't need to really look, but there's gotta be something to find, right? Agent Carter, I'm Agent Nils. Director Falk ordered me to Falk. Is he still alive? Last I heard. Grab that two-way over there to Falk. try to reach him. <laughs> Director Falk. We're gonna radio him on the phone. Director Falk, come in. This is Carter. This is Agent Kinney. The Director and I are defending the sub-level lab. Do you have an escape route? We're maintaining position until you and Nils report for evac. Right. I'm on my way. Get to the advanced materials warehouse and take the elevator to the sub-level. 
We'll hold here as long as we can. Come on, we're, right, we're going, here. we're going. There's gotta be like some declassified things I can find. Is this it right here? Alright, sweet. Answer so loud. Huh, that's not it. Cause I wanna get one at least one achievement, right? First aid kit. Jesus, what's happening up there? I can't even get a first aid kit. Come on, man. Come on, man. Damn. I got a I got shot. I can't even heal myself. This this niche took me out. Alright, here we go. I guess. Oh crap. Run! Where am I going? Alright, there we go. I'm trying to run. Why does this guy get to run? Oh, I got the A. I'm trying to click, click him with my left stick. I was playing Call of Duty, but now I gotta hold A to run. See if you can open the door. I'll meet you inside. Told you I haven't played a shooting game in a while. All right, gotta get that door open. Ah, oh, snap! New weapon. Sorry, soldier. I need this more than you do. Yeah, because you're dead, sucker. A squad commander lives and dies by the choices on the battlefield. Charging into combat only gets a brave soldier shot. If a commander wants to achieve victory over superior forces, they must be observant, creative, and precise. So they're basically going to say that this is like Keep a strategy quiet. shooting here. here. Get in position behind those crates. I'll Get flank them from the window. Opening fire! Nowhere to hide, you bastard! Eat lead! Oh, of course he shoots the ones I'm after. Holding the line. Ah! Haha. <laughs> You're dead. You're dead. They're dead. Let's move. That got him. Let's meet up by the door on the other side. That's pretty crazy that uh, the AI actually did some work. He took out more enemies than I did. What's up? Let's go, hype. Nice shot. The majority of the time was spent uh, yeah, used to be. be me inverting my like controls. We'll see. Really? Damn it. If I paid attention, I would have been able to save that, dude. We probably could have got an achievement for saving him. Damn it. Where did they take him to? You know they didn't carry him off that fast. Get him out of here. Let's get in this tank. So fire on that ship. They are slowing down. Hit him with everything we've got. Incoming! Hold your positions. Keep firing. Cover and position will keep your agents safe and opens the enemy to attack. You can cue actions for your agents, such as moving to a position and firing on an exposed enemy. Watch for opportunities and make every shot count. The battlefield can be what your you ally if you use of it well. Iron Fist. I invert it so when I hit up, it goes down just kind of like flight control. Right. Hold on, I've got an idea. I don't understand. What am I supposed to be doing here? Just the other guy? Oh, uh, second. So oh my gosh, I gotta command people. Why did I have to do this? Cover there! Crossfire. God damn, they're dug in. 
Oh, who shot me? One down. What are these little bastards? We'll figure it out after they're dead. Out of ammo. Sweet. Not really. I guess I should get closer. Dude, what are you doing? Stay down, sucker. You can't handle it. Stay the fuck down. Already here. Or I get more bullets. All right, so I have to we'll finish watching it. No, I don't invert left and right. I've played a game where it was inverted before and it sucks. Some you see the other way, but it is what it is. Whatever the controls are, eventually you'll figure them out, you know? Got the bullets. Is that a big dog? I'm taking out the big dog first. I'm not even, I'm, I don't give orders. I don't like that. It's boring to me. That's it. Let's keep moving. They're closing in. Orders? Hit that button. The elevator will take us down to Director Falk. Damn it. I'm trying to just do it without that. I don't like shotgun. I know a lot of people love shotgun. I'm going to explore just over here just in case. Oh, that's cool. Hit the call button before more of them show up. Alright, calm down, dude. It's called exploration, right? For a reason. There's so much stuff over here. No one wants Jesus. a shotgun. How many of them so we get there? we get a good grenade over here. There's so much ammo here. It's only the first level, so. Nintendo 64. Where do you Nintendo 64 cover? forces you to. Oh crap! I knew I stirred. Jesus. Should have uh, should have got more grenades. It's here. Finish him off. All right, good. We got the big thing down. I can blind fire. That makes things easier. Oh shit, he's coming up the he's he's he ain't fucking around. But he doesn't know who I am. That's it. Let's head down. I ain't playing around either. They're different. <laughs> I think they're giving the orders. The others are just grunts. Jesus. Let's get out of here. Come on, 
The other one's still alive. alive. The old man stuff is Vector, nails. Director Andy's Falk. got Kenny and Weaver to watch his back. Yeah, but who says they can be trusted? They've been with us since the beginning. If anyone's loyal to Falk, it's those two. We're gonna get down there and they're gonna be killing Falk. What the hell are those? We still don't even know who saved us. Keep going! We're getting through! Jesus! Holy hell. Poor bastard. We never stood a chance. We've got to reach Director Falk before they do. Loyalty's got nothing to do with it. Just before the attack, one of our people turned on me. One of ours? I think she was infected with something. Her eyes turned black. She shot me and went after the case I was carrying. She shot you? Yeah. I don't know what happened after that. Whatever was in that case, it killed her. And it saved my goddamn life. So where do we find Falk? What's him? I don't think it matters anymore. Right. Well, we found it a couple of years ago. It didn't take long to figure out that it's an extra tourist. Can't be a coincidence that these outsiders attacked the only Illyrium lab on Earth. I wonder if I have achievements pop up. I might turn them off. I might turn notifications off. I feel like I would have already gotten an achievement, but we'll see. After I beat the first level. I have no idea what it means. Do you? No, you don't. No one knows. We're just here to kill aliens. Snap. You there, stop! Stand Dude. down, soldier. Put your weapon down, sucker. Agent Nils, good to see you alive. Agent Carter, we need to talk. That's right. William Carter, Agent Second Class CIA, reporting as ordered. Now, can I get some answers? You had an artifact to deliver. Do you have it? You may not have noticed down here, but people are dying up there. I would have been one of them if that thing hadn't healed me. Interesting. When we get out of here, my team will want to do some tests. The hell you will. My job right now is to report immediately to Director Frost. We have to assume that the Director of Central Intelligence is dead. Sorry, Carter. The protocols are clear. You work for me now. I don't want to work for a scientist. Why did they attack us? We got a lot of theories. But no answers. Maybe they're from the moon and they don't want us coming there first. This is hardly the time for jokes, Agent Carter. It was a perfect time for jokes. We can't stay here. First, we evacuate this facility. Then, we'll figure out how to strike back. Getting out of here is gonna be tough. I've got to finish securing the research here. Without it, we won't have a chance. You, Nils, and Agent Kinney, collect the commanders in the war room and lead them to the rail platform. Understood. Agent Carter, good to meet you. Save it until we're out of here, Agent. She headed towards the a little while ago. Down there, in the lab. Don't know, don't care. Get into position while they're distracted. I guess since we have three people, it's gonna be vital for me to set them up. I don't know. We'll see here in a second. More of those little grays! Oh, shit. 
it literally has blazer turret. How? Uh, Set up turret. Turret, you got it. Use your cloak. Cloaking. Wait, no, you gotta. They're on the defensive. Get behind cover. Oh shit! They're do he's fighting already. He's on that target. Here goes. Alright, so this turret is badass, and I take back what I said about using my teammates. If they have abilities like that, I'm using them. I'm just gonna keep using the turret. Oh. Because literally, that's it. what's wrong with that? Let's move on. There's nothing wrong with that. I see why Falk wants you for the bureau, Carter. That's what I told him. The aliens just evaporate in the thin air. the war room, collect the brass, and get out. If any of them are left to collect. Cover there! I'm on it! Focus on that one. It's going down. Where's the other one? It should be over there, right? Or are they smart? What are my guys doing? You pull yourself together. You're right there. You didn't help me. And how are they level five? I'm only level one. Alright. 
Alright, I got scared for a second. When I have both earphones on, I can't tell how loud, how loud I'm talking. God damn it. Oh shit. Tell me to give quick orders, and then I gave him quick orders, and it puts him out in the middle of nowhere. It's a joke. I wonder if we can shoot this stuff down. There's three of us taking on one guy. Oh, shit. Move. This is my wall. You go find something else. I were making bombs with the Illyrium. Yeah. Bigger bombs. Yeah, no. Way bigger. Grenades. Let's check this room before we go any further. I feel like I might need to increase my look sensitivity. I feel like I'm looking too slow. Oh, dude, this guy got smoked. Oh, we could have snuck up around here and made it easier. All the different strategies you can implement. I just threw my guys right into the heat of battle. Like Chris Gold, I'll be like, Chris Gold, go straight in. You'll be the moving target. Everyone else will be safe. They're digging? Why? What are they doing? <laughs> First we save the brass, then we evac. I just want to save my own ass. F the brass. Nothing good. Move. Right, sir. Literally, there's one dude outside the door. He could, he's a general. He can't get himself here? out of here. I'll ask the question, son. Yes, sir. Director Falk is at the rail platform. Our orders are to escort you there immediately. Then lead the way. Ah! General! Clear the target, now! <laughs> That's not Deeds. He's one of them! Nils, get back! Just hang on, sir. It's gonna be... Okay! <laughs> That's funny. Why would you rebel yourself? Why did you stop me? What the hell were you thinking? I was thinking that I just saved your life. Nick, who the hell are you? Who are you? What the hell are you doing in the war room? Senior Agent Angela Weaver from the Bureau. The director sent me here to guard the brass. <laughs> you did just fine there. Are any of them still alive? Deems was already under outsider control when I got here. Some of them put up a fight, but not for long. One of their puppets attacked me earlier. 
What's causing this? I'm not sure, but obviously it's connected to this attack. We've been tracking cases like this for years. You knew that he'd killed Hoover and the others. You could have taken him out earlier. I was going to, but he was resisting their control. He might have been able to fight it off. I shot him to stop him from killing the three of you. We have to get out of here. Falk ordered us to bring any survivors to the rail platform. The diesel will only get you as far as the test site. Can we raid over for evac from there? Infection. We're nearly out of time. Get to the I rail the platform aliens. and head out to the test site. Earth I'll call in Sky ago. Ranger, collect and Falk, and meet you there. If you can't reach the test site, we'll have no choice but to leave without you. General oh, Dams. so you're gonna leave us? I can't believe this. All of them. Dead. He's in command now. Falk is. And until we hear otherwise, we assume that he's in charge. For all we know, he's oh, the man, president. Man. You really think they got Kennedy? What? Jesus. What that? Some kind of power source. Like those reactor back there. Those were bombs they were the ground? No. I think they have other plans. What's causing all this? Keep moving. Through them. Ready your weapons. Oh, oh shit, you can shoot your own JS? That's no fun. Oh man, let me get them all at once with one nade. Now that's what you took. Oh dude, one person survived. Fight me. Oh shit, where's he at? What's up, Hoffman? This one isn't. This is like tactical FPS third person. Alright, good night, Triple Topper. Um, what is it called? I don't even know what to say. Oh, T's over! And power up. Get your sleep. I don't want to use strategy, I just want to shoot and kill stuff. So we'll see how well that works. Let's get out of here before this whole place comes apart. I'm about to say it's probably really easy right now, so I can get away with it. But later on, it's going to require me to actually be tactical, put turrets up, use cloaking. What are we waiting for? This is a side story, man. Carter, all aboard! There's two XCOM games, I think Enemy Within and then Made XCOM something else close. for the 360. Carter, we are en route. Face, how far are you in, in uh, Shimu? Did you find the four Wudu? You two, hang on! God damn it! The four Wudu. Yeah, I must have turned my achievements off. Because they're not popping up. I need to go and turn my notifications on. What's up, Jay Bro? Welcome, 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 welcome to the stream. We found two of the four so far. When I was watching you the first night, I was like, I felt like you were gonna give up. You're like, this is so stupid. Who do I talk to? They, they probably wanted to make a 
they always had a probably in the back of their mind they always had a great idea for like a shooting type game but then they wanted to put XCOM on it so it would sell because no one would have bought the game called The Bureau love you too my man Zero love you too should be a radio up there. Oh, but humans I just hope cool. they haven't left yet. You never give up on a game, you just give up on a, a challenge. <laughs> Come on, Carter, radio in and let's get out of here. You radio in, dude. Why do I have to do all the work? Damn. What do I look like? Oh, snipe, uh, sniper. I guess we're gonna get a sniper. Uh, I only have five bullets. I don't like that. Fifteen bullets. Great. Where's the radio at? I'm gonna radio in and then we're gonna get attacked. That's how it always works. Falk. Agent Weaver. Anyone. Copy, Agent Carter. Sky Ranger 1 reads you. I've got Falk nice. and Weaver, and I am inbound to your location. <clears throat> Would you rather head back to the base? Should be fine. As long as we don't start any tests. Right? Here they come! Let's come take them down! Fast. Heads up! They're down below! <laughs> Put up a turret. Turn out! That's your target. Taking it down! Get down! Focus on that target. Let us know where you want us, Carter! In position! Oh shit, I forgot I have a sniper. That was beautiful, wasn't that? Oh snap, I took his head off. They're closing in! They took Dang. out our gun turret! That's not good. I don't need the sniper. This is stupid to have a sniper here. Heads up! Come on, Fox! Come on! That area locked down! More pods incoming! That's your target. My pleasure! Cloak! Focused on that one. It's mine! Cloak activated. Don't know how long we can hold out! If you do your job, I'll do mine. Dude, I feel like I'm hitting this guy like hardcore. Alright, good. He's dead. I can't hit it, I'll do it. Damn. Forces inbound to you. These fellas really? aren't gonna stop. Sky Ranger, how fast can you clear the test site's blast radius? Blast radius? Carter, what are you? I'm gonna start the test sequence. It's the only way to keep them from following us. And get some payback. 
Carter. He's right, sir. Sky Range is built for speed, but it's no match for those outsider ships. All right, do it. Good. Let's give those bastards something to remember. How do I start the test? Oh, here we go. Let's see here. Are you really going to start the test sequence, Carter? You better run, sucker. Listen, we're not safe, and we're sure as hell not done fighting. Do exactly what I say, and we'll get through this. Yes, sir. We're with you, Agent Carter. over here so I can't really Flush it out got a bead we got it coming there it is the sky ranger well, that thing he's done Woo I ranger to Carter Agent Carter respond this is Carter coming well, what is that? we're coming in get on board Come on. There's too many of them. Get on board. Dude, I'm getting in. I'm about to do stop reloading. You're jumping up like in helicopter. I bet you there's an achievement for like lasting uh, a certain amount of waves and then enemies. Oh, mission results. I did all the work. We we're returning to base. I think we did do uh, how a triple topper said we started too late. But it's the life I live. Individual range now, sir. Preparing final approach. Control, this is Sky Ranger 1, requesting permission to land. Copy, Sky Ranger. Permission granted. You are cleared for path number 3. Gonna take more than a hole in the ground to beat those things. Just admit it, you're impressed. So, what is the Bureau anyway? Bureau of Operations and Command. Never heard of it. You were never meant to. We weren't meant to hear about it, but we were. This base an agent. wasn't meant to be operational for another year. We've called in every operative we had earmarked for the project, but, well, let's just say that we'll be a bit understaffed. Director Falk, sir. Welcome back. These two are with me. Well, at least this location is secure. It's and crazy when we used to pick these, these graphics. I'll be getting a report to all staff at 0300. I mean, there's still good graphics, but time. compared to what they I are now. To prepare, Carter. Agent Weaver will show you around. Down here, Carter. Come on. When Ivan put Sputnik up. The brass got scared. This project became top priority. Off the books, of course. That did it. Hold it there. Uh, don't move it. All right, people. Show's over. Back to work. Carter, this is Nico De Silva, senior field agent. Nico, you'll be sharing your workspace with Agent Carter. Welcome to the most advanced facility on Earth. 
You're gonna Both train me to take your ASAP. job, sucker. Time is of the essence. Straight from his mouth. Gotcha. Well, come on. Our office is right over here. Of course they have the black guy running past. For that a brief Weaver cameo. Is tough, bud. So, this is us. This is my desk here. Yours is over there. Get comfortable, Will. Things as they are. This is both your office and your quarters. Do you mind if I call you Will? Yes, I do mind. Well, I'm not calling you Agent Carter. I might be military, but I'm not that formal. I prefer William. Yeah, well, I prefer Nico, even if my mother insists on calling me Nicholas. There's some things that are just beyond our control. I can see we'll be fast friends, you and I. Glad to hear it. My supply of friends got cut a bit short lately. That all, De Silva? Ah, for now, sure. If you have any questions, just ask. And one more thing. Yeah? The old man, Director Falk. He's a hard man to impress, but you managed it. Not what I expected after reading your file. <laughs> Only pleasant surprise I've had all day. How many people around here know my history? We all know each other. Don't worry, you'll get to read up on us too. Stop stalking me. The old man me. thinks that the more attached we are to one another, the better we'll be in the field. The Bureau might be an adjustment for you. I need a new chair. I'm gonna ask for Christmas. Seems like you're more accustomed to operating alone. Yeah, well, I'm also accustomed to the enemy being human. An attack like this is gonna mean a lot of adjustment for everybody. I'm a different man today than I was yesterday, you know? Ain't that the truth. You seem like you know your way around this place. I don't typically work out of this facility. Hell, no one really did until today. I'm with the NSA, but my post for the past few months has been with a small team that reports to Director Falk. Who else is on this team? It was supposed to be kept small until it was needed. Now, people who were pre-flagged for recruitment are coming in. Well, the ones that are still alive. People were pre-selected? From where? From the military, the clandestine service, DIA, even some civvies. No one knew that they were selected until they got the call. As of this morning, Falk activated the project and sent that call out. And before today? For the last few years, it's just been a couple dozen specialists. But now, we've got a lot of new squaddies to bring up to speed. I need to get myself oriented. Let's talk later. Sure thing, Will. Good to have you on board. Sounds like the director's about to start. Come on. Good seats. Man, we're about to have a business meeting. It's life and death. Lights. We are at war, and not the one we were expecting. Groom range, 2100 hours. Survivors, Six. In just a few minutes, our enemy managed to destroy the primary strategic command center. By 2130, strategic command itself ceased to exist. Our combined military forces have been routed. The comms have gone dark. The red phone will no not be ringing. Time. And that is why, as of now, I, Iron Falk, am assuming command of what's left of our nation's defenses. The Bureau was founded to coordinate resistance forces in the event of a complete, successful Soviet invasion. That mission remains the same, even if our enemy does not. We now face an opponent from beyond our world, whose identity is yet unknown. But make no mistake, this enemy has crippled us. They have technology decades beyond what we possess. We must make it our own. Their weapons will become our weapons. And when they do, we shall annihilate them. I give you new orders. Survive. Give me their weapons. Win. Welcome to XCOM.
know I can help them. Let me help them. Will. Will. I have some mental problems right Will. now. Carter. Hey, Will, wake up. <sighs> what? Jesus, Carter. How is it you look worse than before you went to sleep? I'm fine. You yelling for me to wake up doesn't help. <laughs> I wasn't the one yelling. What did I say? Something about a fire. I don't know. I guess after the morning you had, it makes sense. No, this wasn't about that. It wasn't about good range. Well, my guess is you're not the only one having nightmares after this morning. Head shrinking's gonna be a big business after this war. If there isn't after this war. Ugh, Christ, that was dark. Anyway, Falk's looking for you. Wants you in his office ASAP. Were you saying something about that radio? Oh, yeah. Cheap thing normally just pipes in the company elevator music. But it's been picking up some weird signal. Damned if I know what it is. Don't we have more important issues to deal with? Uh, sure, that's why I haven't bothered with it. But if someone on the outside is able to broadcast through that jamming signal, well, it could be important. Who would know more about this? Check with Operator Chelsky. He's information officer for the Bureau. Keeps track of communications, arranges contacts, manages what the public hears. The whole deal. Well, I guess you can't really hold knocking off for a few against me. Seeing as how we seem to be in our office and our quarters. Yeah, and I guess some parts of the emergency plan leave something to be desired. Ah well, it'll be just like college, right? Yeah, except I stayed in Mrs. Hawthorne's boarding house back in Terre Haute. Had my own bathroom and everything. Wow, oh, you fancy. <laughs> I'd better go see what the old man wants. See you later, Will. Two. Message repeats. Two. Five. Zero. Better make a note November. of this and talk to one of the Eight. radio operators. Nine. You probably Two. have to run that by operator Chelsky across the hall. Do I actually Might need to Two. remember the numbers? What's up, Chelsea? You're the dispatcher. A little more than that, Agent Carter. I'm Chief Information Officer with the Bureau. Information officer? What does that mean? I oversee the dispatchers, but in addition to that, I also manage our public communications and keep our profile low. And for now, my job is also keeping the public from knowing the scope of the threat. That's you that's can't shady. keep people in the dark. They need to know. No, people need to be safe. The civilian population can't do much to help this fight, and we have nationwide riots at the news of alien attacks. How are you going to keep all this secret? We actually caught a break there. With the enemy jamming civilian communications, rumors don't spread so quickly. Even so, my operatives and I will have our hands full keeping the public panic level low. There's no way you can keep all this quiet. Let me ask you a question, Agent Carter. Did you know about the Bureau before today? No, but... That's because my operatives and I are very good at our job. Now, if you're good at yours, there won't be much to keep quiet, will there? Radio's been playing a strange broadcast. Any idea what it means? I heard. It's probably an automated weather station nearby, but I suppose it might be instructions for picking up a weaker signal. A clever broadcaster could bypass the worst of the jamming that way. It could be survivors. We could bring them in. It's worth checking out. I'll have Operator Hughes run the radio while you give us the data. First set the range to... Oh my god. Did, did anyone listen to it? Set the range to 100. Now the direction? Dude. Get the fuck out of here. Set the direction north. And the frequency? Set the frequency to 155 kilohertz. Checking low frequency. I've taken enough of your time. Yes, sir.
Cause it's a shooting game and I have to fucking write shit down. What the hell is going on here? That number, so I need. Yes, sir. Radio's been playing a strange broadcast. Any idea? I heard. It's probably an automated weather station. It could be survivors. It's worth checking out. I'll have first set the range to set the range to two fifty. Now the direction. I don't understand what the direction could be. Set the direction north. And the frequency? Set the frequency to 892 megahertz. Checking ultra high frequency. Nothing. W wait. What is. It's survivors. They're trying to warn others of the attack. Reply. Tell them they aren't alone. We'll do what we can to assist. We'll dispatch someone to help, but we'll also have to make sure they stop broadcasting immediately. We can't risk that information spreading. As long as they get rescued. Okay, I don't get an achievement for that. Yes, sir. Thanks for the information. Just do. Uh, I got people saved and I don't get an achievement. Alright, I don't know where to go now. It's all up there. I'm like, I'm hitting a thing. Where am I supposed to go? You were there. Mm. You saw what he was capable of. I did. It's just... This fire paints a different... Okay, Agent. Let's begin. We going on another wild goose chase, Director? Not this time, Agent. Because I brought in an expert agent who I expect to turn the tide. Allow me to introduce your new senior agent, Miss Angela Weaver. Agent Weaver, please begin. Good evening, Agents. Now, we have reason to believe our target is... Some kind of joke? I assure you, I do not joke about potential infiltrate. Come on, Miss. Get back to reception and leave the rework to us, okay? Oh, damn. Watch your toes. Director, how many concrete cases of the outsiders have your agents uncovered to this date? That would be zero. And how many have I uncovered in my own investigations? Two confirmed, one pending. Thank you, Director. If I may continue... Listen up, Agent Percy. Maybe you'll learn how to do your job. Yes, sir. Now, we have reason to believe an infiltrator has compromised military command. Hmm. Speak of the devil. Carter, good. Agent Weaver is afraid you don't play well with others. I think you'll see that as an asset. What do you want from me, sir? You're not here in this facility by chance. I brought you here quite purposefully. I've been following your career for some time. Why me? I've been behind the desk since... for a while. Yeah, but you were a hell of an agent before you sat behind that desk. And what's more, I know what put you behind that desk. The brass put me there. Sure, the brass made the call. 
but it was you who kept yourself there. I don't need another round of psycho babble. I had enough of that from the company shrinks after the incident. It was an accident, Carter. Beyond your control. Right, right, yeah. And next you tell me how I can't save everyone. It's too late for that. But you can save some of them. And right now, that might be enough. Right. Well, I'm with you, Falk. If only because, for all we know, this clown show you're running here is all that's left of a nation's defenses. Then that makes you one of the nation's best weapons. What's our plan? Our first order of business is to get this facility running at full capacity. I believe our best shot at defeating an enemy with superior technology is to take that technology from them and make it our own. And we got the facilities to do that? We're still finishing construction on the lab, but we've already got one of the best leading the team, Dr. Dresner. And he won't be doing it alone. I'm in the midst of organizing field teams to be sent on recon and recruitment missions for other specialists. What is this place? I mean, when aliens from another world aren't attacking our planet. This facility is essentially fulfilling its intended function right now. It was created to respond to a potential invasion on domestic soil. Do all of these people work here? No. Typically, you won't find much more than a skeleton crew here. But certain carefully selected individuals across all military disciplines are aware of this facility's existence. In the case of a domestic invasion, they're under orders to arrive here. I never know about this place. Well, based on your performance at Goom Range, I'd say that omission was a grievous oversight. I'm heading down to the ready room. De Silva will meet you there and help you assemble a team. Get moving. Oh, gosh. We gotta pick a team? They are not playing around with this game. Welcome aboard, sir. What do they look like? Some of them look like us. No way. I've seen them. They look like some kind of... I don't know, some kind of monsters or something. You lost, pal? Well, ready room's... Done. How's it going, Agent Carter? Yes, Director. I'm, I'll tell him I'm, right about to, I'm about to be your boss. Take a seat, gentlemen. <laughs> Director Hall has personally chosen you for this initiative, and I will be your team. We're all honored, I'm sure, but the director wasn't very clear about what we'd be doing. For the most part, it's what you're familiar with. We're all experienced field agents, investigation and recovery. The old man just called down. He says one of the same. This is missing. Disappeared. Along with his research in high explosives. Does Falk think he's gone rogue? Maybe. We can't risk a panic. Mills is tracking them down. We need to get a team ready to help. Quick and quiet. Oh gosh, yeah. someone text me. I'm so tired. Come on, Will. Pick a team. No more flying solo. Assume if your squad member dies, you're permanently gone. That's she's a healer. So my first guys, they were already level up, so now these guys are like bare bones. Alright, I need a military guy with lots of health. Name them. We can name these players. Uh. 
Alright, so I'm gonna pause this. I don't know how. Fuck. Uh, let me go back real quick. Alright, we'll name them afterwards. I feel like I have the ability to heal, so I'm not gonna bring a healer. Hmm. No. Carter, so it's, sick. it's the infiltrator of the morgue. There's no way out Where's of there. Where's your character? Wait for me, Nils. I'll get your back. I'll wait as long as I can, but can't risk leaving him with those explosives. I'm on my way. Carter, head through the armory and take a left for the elevator. I'll send your team up to join you. Damn it, Nils. Hold on. Alright, so here's the game plan. Pause in it here. Uh. I'm tired, I'm gonna go to sleep so I can get some rest, but I'm thinking that maybe uh, we can use some of our chat currency that we have so that we can name characters. Uh, so if you guys think of some cool names for the characters that we have, and we'll, we'll go forward with it maybe five hundred dollars a piece to name a character and then after that maybe well initially I'll just pick the characters and go on the team but once we start getting people that like certain characters maybe it it'll be like two hundred per mission if you really want to select a certain character for me to use in a mission well yeah think about it uh, we should be back like tomorrow night for sure. Uh, hopefully we can start like at 10, 30, 11 or something. So we can at least get an extra hour in. But yeah, I gotta, I gotta go to sleep. I don't wanna start falling asleep mid-mission and then have to go to sleep mid-mission. I, I like to finish the mission. But it's kinda cool that we got to make characters and names. Things like that, so. All right, think of some names. I'll see you guys tomorrow night. Thanks for stopping in. A big team so far. And then power up. I love you guys. <laughs>